Right, we're going over today is metal transfer systems that are used in gas metal arc welding or MIG. There's three main ones, short circuit, globular, and spray. There's some other ones but that are uh, a little bit more rare. But these are the three main. Uh, short circuit is by far the most commonly used. Uh, it makes direct contact with the uh, molten weld pool. It uh, has spatter but not big spatter. Usually you can take it off with a wire wheel. It's also the, uh, the coldest, so it's going to have the lowest wire feed, the lowest voltage, and things like that. If you want to go to globular, I always tell people, just take your parameters from short circuit and increase your voltage. And I'll go out in the lab and show you this here in a minute. Uh, what globular does is kind of balls up on your wire, and then these big droplets float across to the weld. That's why it's called globular. Uh, it's generally considered undesirable. There is some applications for it, um, but usually if you're in globular, you're in between short circuit and spray, and you're going to want to either go one way or the other. Uh, spray, this is the hottest, it's going to be the hottest, or the highest wire feed and the highest voltage, and what happens is if little tiny droplets spray across to the uh, weld. Uh, it's, it produces very little spatter. Uh, globular produces the most spatter. It's usually hard and fused. Uh, spray is used for thick sections. Um, it kind of sounds like a hiss when it goes. What we're going to do is go out in the lab and do each one of these transfer systems. And I'll start it out with uh, regular speed, then I'll go to a slow motion speed, and then back to regular speed for each one of these. So you can kind of see how these uh, transfer systems work. All right, so what we'll do is we'll go out in the lab and we'll take a look at each one of these and uh, see if we can get a good shot of it real up close and personal. All right, here we are at the machine. We're gonna start off with short circuit. Like I said, this is the coldest uh, metal transfer system. So we'll take a look at our settings here on the machine. All right, we're gonna have our wire feed here at 230 inches a minute, and then 17.4 on our voltage. We just finished up our short circuit, now we're going to take a look at the globular and uh, we'll take a look at the machine settings for that. All right, I always tell people just keep your short circuit settings here, leave the wire feet be the, the, the same as you did for your short circuit as you're going to do for your globular and just raise your voltage up to, uh, I don't know, around 24 and that should get us into globular.
globular transfer, we're going to move on to spray. Uh, I just switched machines here because uh, if I was going to go to spray using regular low carbon steel, I would have to go to a different gas mixture. If you have 75-25 on there, then you're going to want to have like a 90-10 or you have to switch it up anyway. But I have an aluminum welder already set up for spray transfer, so we're just going to do the spray transfer in aluminum. And uh, we'll take a look at the uh, settings on this machine. All right, what we got going here is 262 inches per minute and 22.5 voltage.